vlog intro. Here we are, going back to America for the fourth time. Fourth time. Big, big shows this time around. Very excited. Not excited for the flight. Hopefully they feed us good. Three flights. Three flights. A whole day of flying. Melbourne to Sydney. Sydney to LAX. Dallas. Sydney to Dallas. Dallas to Washington. <gasps> Who knows what could go wrong? Stay tuned. Why would you say that? We've got so many exciting things to look forward to <laughs> that could go wrong. I'll keep you updated, all right? Stay tuned. So we made it here after 30 hours of commuting in the air and layovers and three flights and all that jazz. We're here at rehearsal. We have lots of new toys. We have a whole new rack build by BTPA. Hoping it works. First show's tomorrow. One day to figure everything out. And nerves are kicking in. I think something's going wrong right now actually. Hmm. But um, where there's a will, there is a way. We'll figure it out. Everyone's tired. Everyone's jet lagged. Rough sleep last night. But um, it's how we roll. We're now using quad cortexes. Um, first show with them tomorrow. Hope the tones sound sick. Custom tones by Lance, as usual. We picked up this guy. Hey. He's coming along for the ride for a couple of days. Looking after us. That's right. You've got your directed chair there, Lucky. I got nothing to direct. Nothing direct. Don's quadding. Quadding away. Sounds fat, John. Figured I should check in here. We are at Blue Ridge. We've made it. It's mega fucking hot. I'd say like 40 degrees. What's that in Fahrenheit? Like 110? About. About 110 Fahrenheit today. Stupid. Exhausting. Haven't had an appetite all day because of whatever reason. And it's killing me. I believe we hit the stage in under an hour. 50 minutes. 50 minutes. Fingers crossed it goes according to plan and we rip it. But the nerves are kicking in. Lucky we have Yoshi here to save us if anything goes wrong. We got a nice little green room that's a bit trash. AC is not working. I think it is working, but it's too hot to fucking. We have a bunch kick of friends in. bands playing, and they don't have caravan green rooms, so we keep letting yeah. them hang here because we're nice guys. We feel really bad that not all the bands got a green room like us today. Now so it's um. Trash. Yeah. No the next thing you're about to see is us ripping it at Blue Ridge Rock Festival.
right, update. We just played Blue Ridge and it was fucked up awesome. And it started bucketing down with rain. The uh, stage has been evacuated. I think the site's been evacuated. This guy's having a good time. Everything's fucked. The show has been stopped. But we had fun. Time to play a bit of catch up. Um, where were we? Blue Ridge got rained out and cancelled the rest of the night. So technically, we headlined Blue Ridge Rock Festival. We loved our show. Everything went perfect. All the new gear, everything was sick. And we didn't get to watch any more bands that night. It got rained out. I feel really bad for everyone that was there in a tent. That would have been miserable. And then we hung out the next day, got to catch a few bands like Sleep Token, Knock Loose, Motionless in White, Acacia Strain. Very fun day. All went off without a hitch. Back up and running, all looked good. And we left after that night to go to our next show in Spartanburg. And we heard that they shut down everything after that. So uh, somehow it worked out perfect for us, luckily. And then yeah, off to Spartanburg we went to kickstart our little run with After the Burial. That show was fun as fuck. Here's a little bit of... Bounce! 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 So that was the first show down. Fun one. And yesterday was spent having a day off in the middle of nowhere. So I kind of like did nothing. Had a big ass nap, caught up on sleep, and I think I'm good now. But now, if you cannot already tell by the amount of trucks, today is the day we support Lamb of God. The place is insane. I'll take you inside in a second, but holy shit, it's gonna be incredible. Like, we haven't done this sort of thing before, especially over here. Um, arenas, could be our first arena, if I'm not mistaken. I think it is. Whoa. I gotta think on that. If I remember something, I'll, I'll pop back in here. But yeah, god damn it. Let's go look inside. What are you doing, Mitch? Setting up to play with Lamb of God. Is that a Remo? Oh, Remo. Bonk, bonk. So, uh, Lamb of God sound fucking incredible. What the hell? Uh, welcome to our green room. We've got a couch, chairs, showers for everyone to see. Hell yeah, hell yeah. All right, let's recap. We just supported Lamb of God. Amazing. That band is incredible. Holy shit. But uh, our set tonight, something really funny happened. Apparently, 
Pikeville, Kentucky doesn't know what a wall of death is. This happened. And that's the funniest thing that's happened to us in so fucking long. We couldn't help but laugh and fucking... We're never going to forget that. Thank you. What's good, gang? Um, we had a day off yesterday. We went and saw Dayseeker and Silent Planet rip it at this venue we're about to play. Um, keen for it. It is called The Roxy and it's a brand new venue. Everything sounds great, everything looks great. We're keen as hell. People are showing up. Fuck yeah. What can I say? What's up? What's up? We're in Rochester, New York right now. Yesterday was Cleveland, Ohio. Very fun show. Very fun crowd. Lots of awesome people. Beautiful people. Amazing time. Two shows left with After the Burial before we all start the big, bad, touring the end of the world tour with Motionless and White and Knock Loose. So yeah, we are gearing up, we feel ready, we feel prepped, keen, excited, overwhelmed, bring it on. Oh. 